Hi guys, we've already had our Hero of the Week, but Gary Stevenson could have easily made it with this clip. Now for those who don't know Gary, whose channel I link to in the description, he made his money in the City of London some years ago, and is now campaigning against wealth inequality. Gary, who has in the past appeared on the Sunday Rolls with myself and Political Axe, was on the Politics Live show where he explained in the simplest terms possible what levelling up really means. The rich get the cake, the poor get crumbs. Have a listen to this. But even in the southeast, there are poorer, uh, poorer areas that need funding. Is it a good idea? Is this going to transform people's lives in these areas? Well, I mean, if I take £15 off you and then give you £2.80, is that going to transform your life? These guys, they found £2.8 billion to give to local councils. In the last three years, they've given £700 billion to the rich. I know you have. Now you've met... 50 times as much. Listen, is it levelling up if I give a poor person £2.80 and I give a rich person £250? No, sorry, £700. 250 times as much. Listen, this government has presided over the largest and fastest ever increase in inequality in the history of the country. And the most Orwellian thing you've ever heard, they call that levelling up. What do you... Mic drop. <sighs> nobody's talking about this. Why is nobody talking about this? Why is the mainstream media talking about immigration or they're talking about... Um, seat belts, <laughs> or they're talking about some other. They're talking about Boris Johnson. Why are they not talking about this? How over the last number of years, billions, literally billions of pounds, have been funneled into the pockets of the richest in society at the expense of everyone else. And I have to come back to wh what I've talked about before on the channel about how. If you're a member of the European Union, when the UK was a member of the European Union, money from Brussels would go to deprived areas. Why? Because those areas needed the cash. It created jobs, it uh, improved infrastructure, it done wonderful things in those deprived areas. What's happening now, through levelling up and the uh, prosperity fund, is money has been handed over to councils in order to hold on to power. And we're seeing it with Rishi Sunak. Rishi Sunak's constituency is, earning, is receiving more money than really deprived constituencies. Why? Well, it's in order to uh, gain favour with the voters. That's the difference with European money and money that's coming from central government. Central government, in, in many cases around the world, what they do is they funnel money into areas where they want to hold on to a seat or to win over a seat. And now it's been sold as levelling up, taking money from, from people in taxation and cutting public services and handing it over to people who don't need it. In this case, it's constituencies that don't need it, um, Rishi Sunak's, for example, and not giving it to places that do need it, where it, there's high levels of unemployment and there is very little industry. But once again, very few people, with the exception of Gary, is talking about this. Let me know in the comment section, guys, what you think about all of this. As always, your comments are greatly appreciated. Thanks a lot.